very good and early morning from Ikaduwa. Yep. Ikaduwa, still the <laughs> south coast of Sri Lanka. This is a beach that is famous for not laying on the beach but snorkeling and yeah, diving. Yeah, we are in a place called Coral Reef and here supposedly that you can see really big big turtles, a lot of fish. Uh, we see already a lot of people in the water so we're just gonna show that to you very very soon. And a lot of boats and a lot of other stuff and by the way we're not only here in Hikadua today we are also going to Gaul yes. to check out a Dutch Fort and something else that Dutch built somewhere. Yes, so more <laughs> is coming, but now a uh, first peak of Hikadua. <laughs> So guys, as you see, there are lots of boats, uh, people snorkeling and we are in the process of trying to find out where you can party because this place is the party place of South Sri Lanka, yeah, correct? Yeah, in the South Coast of, of Sri Lanka, Ikaduwa is the place if you want to enjoy a really good night life. But the funny thing is that it's 8 o'clock in the morning and we don't party that much but we just want to check it for the people that do it. Isn't that nice of us? So <laughs> off we go. We are driving here in Ikaduwa at the moment trying to find the clubs, the bar or party. whatever. But I think the nightlife is probably on the beach at night. Yes. The only thing we found is a bus station. Well, Ex good news is that you can get here, but uh, yeah, you'll have to find out yourself how you can party the night away here. But don't say we didn't try. No, no, we because tried. Because we tried. <laughs> and right now we are going to continue our journey to go where you will find the Dutch fort and... Yeah, that's what we're doing. And right now Hugo has to focus on, this, on the exactly. road because I am. It is, driving it is, in Sri Lanka It is a bit hectic, buses are totally crazy So, and I am a man which means I can't do two things at the same time So Noemi takes over, I'm going to go See you there! See you there. I've said it many times, I know I would change my ways, I know for sure When all the crows decide to meet They settle down beneath my feet We just arrived at the Dutch port and it's quite funny, I saw the Dutch flag which made me feel a little bit home as it is my country but another funny thing is that we just came across a school and the kids are doing like a little dance Yeah, so guys, basically in Gaul a lot of things are happening. Kids are dancing, there's a fort and I've seen a big cricket field as well. So we're first gonna start with the fort, but I'm excited to be here. We have found the fort and I'm actually walking on it right now. Of course it's a fort, so I don't have to explain what that is, but it has a really chill vibe and it's pretty impressive and you got like this tower of the fort and there we have Noemi. What do you think of the fort? I like it. I like the area. It's really like Europe. Like yeah, it's right? really quiet and beautiful and like these small houses and everything is pretty. So guys, I just flew the drone, but there was something interesting. There was like a guy in an army suit and another guy saying that I needed to ask permission to the Department of Archaeology. Very difficult word. Uh, so if you think to come here and fly your drone, don't do it. Ask for permission, do it the right way. However, I did get my footage, so of course we will share that with you. And right now we're just taking some pictures. And after that we might explore a bit more of Gaul, because this area is really cool. There's a lot of things happening and... Yes, yeah, so we want to show that. It happened again. 
Noemi has seen something that she likes, just like on Guillaire. But now this time it's not a dress, it's a hat. And look who is there. But it's like too much fluff off. It's like... <laughs> <laughs> That's not that bad, but it looks a bit strange. It's not the kind of shape that I look for. I think you want a bit of a bigger one. Yes, I want like the one that I had back in Canada. Mommy, send it to me, please. <laughs> I want my hat! <laughs> Maybe it is good to say though that here at the Gulf Fort you have a few of these shops but yeah. it's not really touristy that there are a lot of people right now. No, right now I was really impressed. I, w I thought that it would be really crowded but... Uh... It is not. You have a lot of little shops yeah. and we still want to explore a few more streets. We're gonna go there because I'm not able to find an ad right we now. We continue the mission? Yes. The mission for the hat is a big fail because... It's all the same style of ads they're, everywhere. They are all the same hats and they just don't look so great on Noemi. They look really... Ugh. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, we are driving through the streets and they are really small and really cute and they really feel Dutch or European. Yeah. But we were like, we can show it to you by vlogging but we can also just take a little slow motion put some music on so you can sit back and relax <laughs> take a bit of popcorn and enjoy the streets of the golf fort the golf fort We just left the Dutch fort. And, and now we are walking into the city of Gaul. Yes, because not many people really go into the city, but this city has something magical. It's yeah. extremely busy, but it has lots of cool stuff and we just want to share it with you. Yeah. So let us take you into the city of Gaul. So Noemi has found some... Pineapples, look! Wow, there's like an entire truck of pineapples. Is this a good one? Yes. Ready for today. You want anything? No, I'm a good, I am good, baby. Oh, this shade is nice. We get to the spice market. Yes, maybe that's good to say because there is like a spice market where you get the real price and not the tourist price. Yeah. Somebody advised us to go there. And it's close to the point where the tsunami hit actually 13 years ago. So let's go there. Let's go to the spice market. There we have a beautiful building that has been here for 200 years. And it has been hit by the tsunami 13 years ago. So this one survived the tsunami. You can see it has been hit. It has this beautiful color. Now we are walking towards the spice market and we're like in this little street, no other people, only local people who are looking at me right now while I'm vlogging, but hey, I'm vlogging and that's okay. So you have turret, normal curry, meat and fish curry, rose curry, bam, bam. and cinnamon. Do you want cinnamon? I want cinnamon. Shall we take a cinnamon and a turmeric? Yes. Because it's healthy and nice. No. Jaiti. <laughs> we won't have any budget left after this. It's gonna fit in my luggage. Smell it. Can I smell? Oh wow. I know. Wow. It is my favorite. Oh. You can have fun like this? Perfect for backpacking. Would you advise people to go to this little shop? Yeah. Yeah. It's okay, nice, yeah, right? Yeah, it's really nice. Okay, no tea. It's too expensive. Maybe. The it's tea the is best. 880. Yes, the best number one tea, ma madam. When you yes, drink, I you know. are not looking for money. <laughs> My word. <laughs> yes. When you are drink one cup of tea, then you say, oh, not for the money, but, but the tea is the best. But babe, are you going to drink this every day? No, no. Are we gonna use the cinnamon? Yes. And the turmeric? A little more. So, shall we buy that? Yes, okay, only these two. But guys, this is 
the best tea of Sri Lanka. If you're drinking tea every day. If you're drinking tea every day. It's not about money, it's about tea. We just bought some spices and we bought a pineapple and we feel like we've been grocery shopping, but then in Gulf. It's nice to say that you have a lot of colorful buildings here. Some are still destroyed because of the tsunami, but I think they built it up really, really well. And it is time to say goodbye to Gaul for us. It's also time to say goodbye to you guys because this is the end of the vlog. Yes. We hope you enjoyed seeing the fort. We hope you enjoyed seeing Hekadua. And if you liked any of these things, just give us a like, a thumbs up, ask us a question and make sure to see our next vlog. So until then, 